Hey, welcome back folks. So we're out here again in Lehigh Acres. We're doing a, another removal. This colony is underneath a basketball hoop. So basically before Hurricane Irma this past September, the homeowner tipped over a basketball hoop and a colony of bees found their way uh, right into it. So I figured I'd grab the camera and bring you guys along for the ride. Uh, let's see if we can't remove these bees, but uh, I really wanna show you a closer look at uh, what they look like. Gorgeous, gorgeous colony. Uh, very gentle and docile too. So check this out. So you'll see right here we have a, uh, a tipped over basketball hoop this a uh, bottom piece of it and uh, this I believe is a uh, Brazilian pepper bush uh, pretty invasive species here in Florida but check out this colony of bees That is one big old colony of honeybees. And you'll see they got a lot of uh, fresh, fresh comb. See how white that color is? But the bees look very healthy. I don't see any, uh, any deformed wings if you look real closely at them. But uh, I'll show you my setup here. Basically, real simple. I have frames with rubber bands ready to go. I got a 10 frame box with a bottom board. And we got a lid, a rubber made tote for putting in the honeycomb. Uh, we got a, a little piece of board here for a cutout. But uh, let's wrangle these bees. So I'm gonna try to work on this side. I'll use a little bit of smoke move the bees, cut the comb, and then any comb that has eggs, larvae, or brood, I'll rubber band, but any of the comb that's only honey stores, uh, I'll put in the Rubbermaid tote. So let's see how this goes. Little difficult positioning the camera here. So we moved the first piece of comb and we got drone brood already. So this will be another piece we'll remove. Okay, so now we still see some more brood. We got some worker brood up here. <clears throat> and we got more drone brood by the looks down here. Looking for the queen. This one I gotta cut in half and take out in pieces. It's such a big piece of comb. Come on girls, get away from the edge. Get away from there.
this is kind of a difficult removal just because of the weeds that I'm in but now we're getting into a nice section of brood this is all brood comb here first one that spots the queen gets an ice cream nothing yet so we'll keep wrangling Well, folks, I uh, didn't really get a lot of that on video. Basically, you got the idea. I uh, slowly cut comb by comb out, one at a time. We, uh, we got them in this 10 frame box. This was a really big colony here. Super, super gentle bees. And we did find the queen. So, I got the queen in the cage there, but uh, we're just gonna let these bees acclimate and uh, hopefully come back at night and relocate them. We got a little cluster here on the on the pole, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Mm -hmm. 